So it's been few days that I picked up, you know, my notebook here to study. And I just was scrolling through it now to relearn my last lesson. And I realized I'm forgetting words of like the clothing words. So I know it's La Rupa. I know dresses. Uh, is it El Vestido? Yeah, I got that one. I know chaquetas. I know zapatos. I know pantalon. You know, but I think I've forgotten what belts in you know, socks. But looking at it now, it's refreshing my brain. So I know socks is los calcetines. Belt is belt 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 i know it's cinturon but i don't know if it's hell or yeah it's el cinturon and uh a uh, 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 coat is a coat yeah coat is a uh, el abrigo you know i know skirt is falda is it la falda yeah la falda mm. so i just realized that even as you're learning you need to be going back to like the very beginning of your because why are we why am i jotting it down why am i having a notebook is to go back and you know skim through what i've learned before and you know just refresh my brain with it you know so that's what i'm doing now before i get to my lesson which is about regular verbs in spanish like trae means to carry or bring but if I want to say, like, I bring, it's going to be trigo, 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 trigo. Asar, I'm going to say, I do or I make, it's going to be ago. So those are what I need to learn this night before I go back to taking my, you know, continue the lesson, actually. So you're just going to see me um, revising. Okay, for today's lesson, I've um before starting, I have you know revised my last lesson. Although I still need to do more because I'm not like there are some things I need to practice before I know them. So now I've revised them, and tomorrow I would be um practicing them through my day. And um, it's literally today. It's already midnight, and right now today's lesson is. How to order food in Spanish that is my next lesson even though I may not be needing it but you know I still need to go through the right routes to get into that point always try to write today's date in Spanish whenever I'm taking my lesson so today is Wednesday 30th August 2023 so it will be L train. 30 eh, el 30 de agosto 2023 and sometimes i like to write the time so it's currently 12 11 a.m so i'm just gonna say i'm just gonna say son las dos son las doce y once son las doce y once and the um the subject the title of today's lesson is how to order food in spanish and today you're going to be able to talk about it you'll be able to discuss what you like what you don't like and also just know a whole lot of food related words maybe next time you're in a restaurant that uh, is a spanish-speaking restaurant maybe you can try to order also state what you want and put it into practice okay
okay so guys i am done with my lesson and i've gotten so many words of fruits down this food drinks fruits desserts you know i think that's how it yeah drinks fruits yeah vegetables los vegetales did i get that let me see yes los vegetales la frutas mm. Bebidas, uh, postres, that's dessert, and comida is food in general. And I want to say I'm hungry. Tengo hambre. Tengo hambre. Tengo hambre. Dame comida. Dame comida. Tengo hambre. Oh, 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 let's see. Lo, oh, are. Hmm? O lo haré, o lo haré, comer tú, o I'll eat you. That's what I wanted to say. So I'm saying, tengo hambre, dame comida, uh, dame comida. Let me see, let me find a specific word to say. I want, um, dame comida, uh, yo quiero, yo quiero el plátano. El plátano eh, con el plátano con um, el plátano con eh, la té cali, de calien, calienta. I want to say it with hot tea. <laughs> That's a very odd food. <laughs> Why would I want to eat plantain and hot tea? Anyway, guys, so this is it. I'm going to like go over it when I wake up. This is what I do at night. I take my lesson. I go through it like one more time. Then when I wake up, I go through it. And so throughout the day, I keep telling myself, I'm talking to myself. And thankfully, I do cook. So that is what I'm going to be doing. I'm just going to be identifying the items. I'm like, hey, I know that one. Hey, I know that one. And I'm going to be using up in synthesis. So when I come back for my lesson tomorrow, it's just going to flow right. So I am excited guys. You might not get this kind of detailed lesson for tomorrow, you know, but I just wanted to share guys how I learn every night and how I go about it. So for tomorrow night it's just going to be me talking about what I learned instead of showing you the whole process because that will mean a long vlog. And I'm not sure we want a long vlog. Well until you guys tell me you want a long vlog, that is when I'll give you that. But for now, I'm really excited that I'm gotten like, I think that's about 30 different words of foods and drinks, the sad fruits, you know, like, I just need to get um, used to the pronunciation. And here we go. So now I'm about to watch K-drama. I just downloaded it. 25, 21. Bye. See you tomorrow. <laughs> Buenos días. <laughs> Quiero desayunar. Estaré comiendo amala y he oído estofado. Entonces, hasta luego. <laughs> Chicos, tengo hambre. Realmente aprendo. <laughs> Where I am still working, so I'm going to put up food for later. As you can see, I'm in my kitchen. <laughs> I came to just quickly let you guys know what I learned last night and it was about family and it's family related. You know, I kind of know most of them, you know, but I don't know like cousins, niece, nephew, you know, uh, hermano, hermana, abuelo, abuela, sobrina, sobrino, nieto, nieta. And I can also say like her name is, so I say, ella se llama, ella se llama. Mm. Deborah, <laughs> and I want to say like first, second, third, fourth. I'm still kind of getting it, but I know it's primero, segundo. I don't know third, but I know the one is cuarto, one is quinto, sexto, you know, like that. So I'm still getting around it, and I'm, I'm really enjoying it. And I also got to know about the possessive adjectives that you know, like I want to say my house, me, mi casa. I want to say your arms is 
to Casa. I already know the songs before we even got here. But it's the Su, it's Su Casa. I know Nuestro, uh, but I, don't, I did not know Vuestro. And uh, Su also is used for Is, Are, uh, and um, Is, Are, uh, and Dear. So I think it also goes with Dear's, but I'm not sure if it's changed to Su. Because it told uh, the teacher mentioned something about um me. If I'm not say like me, my favorite food to be me comidas favoritas, Miss comidas favoritas. So I was like, okay, is sauce going to change to sauce? It sounds like sauce in English, like that so sauce. <laughs> anyway, guys, that's it so far. I hope to learn more today. Peace out. It's been two nights that I haven't studied Spanish. Hopefully, you guys <laughs> get to study this night. I'm out currently right now with my family. Came out to eat. <laughs> I look a bit disorientated. <laughs> hi guys i know i don't look really good <laughs> but i want to end this vlog right here because last night when i got home i was celebrating something special so when i got home i was really exhausted the only thing i could do i did not even eat dinner the only thing i could do last night was watch key drama even chatting i couldn't right now i'm about to have what we call gary here in Nigeria, well, we came up with this fun name for it on the internet called groceries. <laughs> so we call our Gary groceries, and I had to buy this and this outside. This is sugar, and this is granite. We'll call this sweetener. I will call this floating berry. I'm gonna be having it in this cup. Let me get myself a spoon. I'm not sure. This spoon does not look clean. Okay, this one looks clean. Then this is the Gary, but it's actually cassava flakes. So there is a way they process it. You know, cassava. I think. I don't know. Don't let me. Don't let me. Don't let me mess up. <laughs> I don't know how it's being processed, but it's made from cassava. And I'm sorry about the overexposure of this video there's nothing i can do about my window and i do need the light so sorry <laughs> so i buy this packaged gary but there are some people that sell it just by measuring but those ones usually have like sand in it sometimes so this is the one i drink so i'm just gonna pour a bit of it here in the cup Like this. This is our Nigerian cereal. If you come to Nigeria or you're any part of the world and you get an African store, I'll recommend you trying our curry and sugar and granola. If you have milk or like a chocolate, you know, stuff, put it inside. Only works as well. Mm, I'm gonna be having quite a bit of it. <laughs> Let me bring my camera up to show you guys. I'm not sure see the quantity. So yeah. I'm gonna be having it that way. So I'm going I'm just going to pour this here. It's usually clean. Sometimes so people sieve out the water. So like the first water you pour, you're gonna you know, sieve it out and that. So I'm just gonna pour this and pour it. After adding all of that, I just had water and I drink it immediately. I don't like my garlic being soaked. 
that's just how you enjoy it so i'm ending it here and i know that this week i did not really do much i think i only had two lessons this week i didn't study much and this is why because i don't want to forget what i learned i've been so exhausted this week you know so i i'm not trying to attempt something that i'm just going to keep forgetting I don't want my diary to soak too much <laughs> what it is so that's just it guys but I promise for a very interesting vlog this coming one what I'm trying to do is not just showing you me learning it like there will be a, like one day I'll show you what I'm learning and other days I'll, I'll just show you me implementing what I've studied in my daily life so I'm really enjoying this I've just been busy to even vlog this week so I hope you guys enjoy this and um, if you want to keep following me on my learning journey my Spanish learning journey please hit that subscribe button turn on the notification bell like this video and keep updated <laughs> keep being updated by everything I'm doing I plan for something very very interesting you guys are seeing me <laughs> in different looks I'm always, you know, dolling up for the videos, but this is me. This is how I look, and I'm proud of it. Mm -hmm. See you guys in the next vlog or video. Bye. Adios.